in this video i'm going to give you the answer of the question does co2 follow or obey the octet rule the answer is yes co2 compound follows or obeys the octet rule let me prove that you know that carbon is an element of group 4a that is why it has four valence electron and oxygen is an element of group uh, 6a that is why it has six valence electron to fulfill octet carbon uh, will share four electron and oxygen will share two electron that is carbon will uh, make bond four and oxygen will make bond uh, uh, two so look the here we have one carbon it will make four bond and oxygen will take two bond so here we have uh, two oxygen atom so now here we have used look here two four six eight so here just we have used eight valence electron out of a carbon has four and every oxygen has uh, six that is uh, 4 plus 12 that is 16 so out of 16 we have used here 8 right we have 8 valence electron left so to fulfill octet we'll put here two pairs and here two pairs so 2 4 6 8 10 12 14 16 right so here we have used the 16 valence electron this is the Lewis structure right now we have to <coughs> count the octet of carbon this carbon has look we can uh, replace this bond by dot right by dot we can replace this bond by dots so look this carbon has 8 right this oxygen has 8 and this oxygen has 8 so this oxygen is following the octet root this carbon is following the octet root and this oxygen is also following the octet root uh, rule so we can say that co2 follows the octet rule look in Lewis structure the bonding electron will be shared by the two atoms equally right so when we are counting the uh, octet for oxygen we are counting the bonding electron totally right so I think you have got on the answer you have got the answer thank you you have gotten the answer.